Hey guys, Dan the Wolfman here, thecombatsystem.com. I'm just going to play around with the concept again. I'm not a master of it yet. You know, obviously, you can't go full speed. you got to be careful. But I'm going to be intercepting some takedown attempts here. Now, obviously, we're not in a full fight, mixing up takedowns with strikes, so it makes things different. But I'm going to intercept his vision and let him run into my hands. Instead of just worrying about my hips and sprawling, even in wrestling, the first line of defense is your hands. Hands, forearms, elbows, head, then your hips, right? Um, Theoretically, and it is a bit theoretical, but I could work with my hands first. The first one's not that, but if he's coming in on me for a takedown, all that defense. I have, I have a video on that, I put it out, and then later um, McSweeney used it against Hodger Gracie in 1FC. Okay? You're just sinking your weight, dropping your weight. Um, but I can work all kinds of ways, come with the same takedown. Anyone think I'm not in a good place for a fight? Okay. I just let him run into my hands first instead of just, oh my god! I'm just gonna play magic. Put out here. Break his structure, however. Okay. Good. What? Yeah, so um, whatever speed you want, whatever takedown you want. Okay. First show proving that tie one handed against the light. Sort of. And a gay face, kind of. Whatever. Okay. I'm just intercepting and good things will happen. Yes, I'm bigger. Yes, whatever. Yes, I know he's shooting. But it's showing you concepts. Okay. So you can come double or come in fast, whatever you want. Akita. Became a little bit of real wrestling. Never said he shouldn't know how to wrestle. Where the eyes go, the head goes, the head goes, the body goes. Basic wrestling stable. Basic wrestling. Okay, I can go. Just for some people. I'm going on the bottom. But. Um, you see, I'm just going to place my fist on his face. Let him run in a punch. Let him run into a slap and manipulate from there. This is helping your wrestling. This can help your wrestling in MMA. Okay, we'll keep going in a minute. Try not to look low. Try to really come in. Street applications, obviously, in a real situation. Some of this wrestling, yes, it is. But it's also something else. Look, I know where he's shooting, right? My hips. He's coming in. Listen to the center line. Go so. Oh, thank you for running into my punch. Thank you for running into my punch. And now I can twist your head. Your structure is broken. Whoop. Third body lock. Okay. A couple more. A couple more. 
never told him I wasn't going to punch him in the body. <laughs> I could intercept him from that way, too. The boys MMA are assaulted by him. Yeah. Well, I could slap him in the body and then go to his. Right? I know it's coming. Let him run into the wall. Now you see how breaking structure becomes easy if you know how to hit. You okay? <laughs> he ran into the wall. I won't, I won't really hit this time on this one. But obviously I can soften up the target first. Trying to wrestle with me, man. Just some principles of biomechanics on the neck, the face, the body, and working them together. And you see, um, once I work with strikes, things become a little more open. You okay? Can you take one, one or two more? Okay, I might hit you in the body, but, but don't come in here. Try not to me. Cut to the body. That's all you need to do. Let him run into the wall. You guys saw that. You can stop a takedown simply with a punch slash cross face, redirecting his neck, breaks his structure, spins him spirally. Hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe. Thank you. Okay.